Deus in adjutorium meum intende, Domine ad adjuvandum me festina, Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, Sicuterat in principio, et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Alleluia. O gladsome light of holy glory, from deathless Father, heavenly holy, Blessed One, O Jesus Christ, Alleluia, Most High. We come to sunset and we see, Tis time to raise our twilight hymn, Alleluia, 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 Most High. We sing to Father and to Son, to Holy Ghost, we sing to God. Alleluia, 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 Most High. And worthy art Thou in all times, that ceaseless songs should sound thy praise. Alleluia, 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 Most High. O Son of God, tis life thou givest, so gives the world to thee its glory. Alleluia, Alleluia, Alleluia. Most High. Amen. Let your holy people rejoice, O Lord, as they enter your dwelling place. O Lord, remember David and all the many hardships he endured. The oath he swore to the Lord, his vow to the strong one of Jacob. I will not enter the house where I live, nor go to the bed where I rest. I will give no sleep to my eyes, to my eyelids I will give no slumber, till I find a place for the Lord a dwelling for the strong one of Jacob. At Ebrathah we heard of the ark, we found it in the plains of Erim. Let us go to the place of his dwelling, let us go to kneel at his footstool. Go up, Lord, to the place of your rest, you and the ark of your strength. Your priests shall be clothed with holiness, your faithful shall ring out their joy. For the sake of David your servant, do not reject your anointed. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Let your holy people rejoice, O Lord, as they enter your dwelling place. The Lord has chosen Zion as his sanctuary. The Lord swore an oath to David, he will not go back on his word. A son, the fruit of your body, will I set upon your throne. If they keep my covenant in truth, and my laws that I have taught them, their sons also shall rule 
on your throne from age to age. For the Lord has chosen Zion, He has desired it for His dwelling. This is my resting place forever, here have I chosen to live. I will greatly bless her produce, I will fill her poor with bread. I will clothe her priests with salvation, and her faithful shall ring out their joy. There David's stock will flower, I will prepare a lamp for my anointed. I will cover his enemies with shame, but on him my crown shall shine. Gloria Patri et Filio, et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio, et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. The Lord has chosen Zion as his sanctuary. The Father has given Christ all power, honor, and kingship. All people will obey him. We praise you, the Lord God Almighty, who is and who was. You have assumed your great power. You have begun your reign. The nations have raged in anger, but then came your day of wrath, and the moment to judge the dead, the time to reward your servants, the prophets, and the holy ones who revere you, the great and the small alike. Now have salvation and power come, the reign of our God and the authority of his anointed one. For the accuser of our brothers is cast out, who night and day accused them before God. They defeated him by the blood of the Lamb, and by word of their testimony, love for life did not deter them from death. So rejoice, you heavens, and you that dwell therein. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. The Father has given Christ all power, honor, and kingship. All people will obey him. A reading from the first epistle of St. Peter. All of you should be like-minded, sympathetic, loving toward one another, kindly disposed, and humble. Do not return evil for evil, or insult for insult. Return a blessing instead. This you have been called to do that you may receive a blessing as your inheritance. The Lord has given us food, bread of the finest wheat. The Lord has given us food, bread of the finest wheat. Honey from the rock to our heart's content, bread of the finest wheat. Glory to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The Lord has given us food, bread of the finest wheat.
Te posuit potentes de sede, et exaltavit humiles. Magnificat anima mea dominu, et exaltavit spiritus meus, in Deo salutari meo. Quia respectit humilitatem ancile sue, ecce enim ex hoc beata medicent omnes generationes. Quia fecit mihi magna qui potens est, et sanctum nomen eius, et misericordia eius a progenies in progenies, timensibus eium. Fecit potentiam in brachio suo, dispersit superbos mente cordis sui. Deposuit potentes de sede, et exaltavit humiles. E suriente simple vit bonis, et divites dimisit inane. Sushepit Israel puerum suum, recordatus misericordiae sue. Sicut locutus est ad patres nostros, Abraham et semeni eus in secula. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Te posuit potentes de sede, et exaltavit humile. Let us call upon Christ, the Good Shepherd who comes to the aid of his people. Hear us, O God, our refuge. Blessed are you, Lord, for you graciously called us into your holy church. Keep us within the church until death. Hear us, O God, our refuge. You have given the care of all the churches to Francis, our Pope. Give him unfailing health, lively hope, and loving concern. Hear us, O God, our refuge. Grant the grace of conversion to all sinners and the grace of true repentance to all men. Hear us, O God, our refuge. You were willing to live as a stranger in our world. Be mindful of those who are separated from family and homeland. Hear us, O God, our refuge. To all the departed who have hoped in you, Grant eternal peace. Hear us, O God, our refuge. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. O oh God, who in your mercy led Saint Clare to a life of poverty, grant through her intercession that, following Christ in poverty of spirit, we may merit to contemplate you one day in the heavenly kingdom. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Dominus nos benedicat et ab malo defendat et ad vitam pertucat eternam. Amen. 
Salve Regina, Mater Misericordiae, Vita Dolce Do, Et Spes Nostra Salve. Ad te clamamus, exoles filieve, ad te suspiramus, gementes et flentes, in hac lacrimarum vale. Ea ergo, advocata nostra, Illos tuos misericordes oculos ad nos converte. Et Iesum benedictum fructum ventris tui, nobis post hoc exilium ostende. O Clemens, O Pia, O Dolcis, Virgo Maria.